Hello, you have tuned in to Pokemon Go Battle with the Best of Them, here with Dr. Gakman. Um, these are the results, or the vlog, for the last month for 2021, March. Wow. So, here's uh, my pictures. I'm only going to show you pictures. I'm going to try something different this, this video. 777, that's rare. Um, there's a one click on the attack, probably. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try something different. I always complain about these videos are too long. Um, running the app and running this recording program that I use to record these is kind of difficult uh, at the same time. Like it, it slows down and then I, you know, blah, blah, blah. But you'll see at the end of this, at near the end of these pictures, you'll see um, how I'm compensating for that and hopefully going through these quick, quicker. So that was shinies at the time. <clears throat> these were, uh, I was trying to get Articunos when they did this <laughs> and here they are. There's a butt ton of Zapdos and a couple of Moltres. So it was kind of, wow. But, uh, yeah, they had this weekend where they were there or whatever. And there's 666. You'll see that a lot in this video. I don't know what's going on with Pokemon Go with showing me that. But maybe we're the, near the end. But <laughs> um, this is my Lantern Shiny, by the way. Uh, both bunnies. I thought that was kind of cool. But you'll see, we'll see throughout the month we'll be getting a lot of bunnies. This is also when they had the Springtime Deerling. Which those were everywhere. Why didn't they do that with the other deerlings? Now I know that they changed the uh, weather weather pattern uh, or the weather. You're gonna have northern and southern hemisphere type spawns, and uh, the seasons are gonna change more drastically. Or uh, I guess with with what different spawns there are, since there are so many Pokemon in Pokemon Go now, that I mean it makes sense to you know shift them around and stuff. So. And here I am, continuing to go. Uh, there was this problem that I was having earlier in the month. It was a glitch or something where, like, if I spun a stop and then I go back out from the stop, my character was still continuing to go off the map, but my map was stuck in one spot, like right here. But here's my here's my dude going off map. That happened a couple of times, so I just took a picture of it. Uh, you know, there's glitches that happen all the time. This was shortly after the um, we got the shiny ditto for the silly uh, Kanto event where every Kanto Pokemon went shiny, right? And then I was like, well, how are they going to do this? Supposedly the word now is, is that they're not going to have shinies in the wild. Uh, you are only going to get one shiny, which is kind of funny because you could trade it and then you're, you're, you're screwed if you trade out, trade out your last one. You'll never get another one. I'm sure they'll make it to where they, they do that in the future or whatever. But then I was like, what is going to be Ditto? They changed the roster of which ones are going to be Ditto. Um, and again, it's going to be Pokemon that can't be shiny. So they took Paraz off because that one can be shiny now. And I, got, I got to talk about Paraz later on. So, <laughs> um, or Paris, as some people call it. It's the little parasite crab. Anyways, um... It says catch a ditto, and I held on to that for the longest time, and then, you know, when April Fool's hit, that's that's when they had dittos out. So, I, I was I was smart to hang on to it, I guess. <laughs> Next picture, Arcanine. Now, Arcanine was originally, in Kanto, supposed to be a legendary. So, they were saying that Arcanines were going to start appearing in the wild, and they could be shiny. I think all Pokemon in the wild, well, it... Once they release them shiny, all of their different forms, their you know, you know their uh, family should be shiny. But you know that's not how it works. I guess not in Pokemon Go. I think it'd be rarer to to find like a later evolved form in the family shiny. But still, though, they, it should still be possible. But this is one of them that was supposedly going to be shiny. Um, I also had my frillish on radar now the only way to get the male one although they're going to do that with special research in april i guess or the research break breakthrough it, the only way to get the male one 
um, was through the Go Battle League, which I still uh, I hadn't gotten one. I I don't even have a a Pikachu or the I didn't get a rough lift through it or either either the uh, Pikachu Libre. Anyways, those those Go Battle League ones they're just they take up too much time that I don't have. So <laughs> I love the game, and eventually I will get into it more. But for now, it's it's kind of rough. And some of those are shiny too, so that kind of blows my mind. Anyways, um, <clears throat> but there's Frillish. It's only the female form. And there's Arcanine in the Wild. My first Landorus when they became... I'm not joking. My first one. So I didn't even do it anymore. So... Was... Um, uh, shiny. So, and it's... Probably the best of the trio of the uh, incarnate forms um, was Landorus um, because he's not as affected by certain things. He's he's double weak to ice. I'll tell you that because it's he's a ground type and flying type. But but you know, <clears throat> compared to the other ones, there's there they have more weaknesses and and he's just better to use and stronger overall. But uh, this pic next picture shouldn't be in here, but whatever. Um, <laughs> here is, um, yeah, it's shiny. It was Battle of the Best of them. I didn't get the shinies of the other two, so I'm still missing three shiny legendaries, which were the Tornadoes, the, um, whatever the other one is, I'll, I'll remember it later, and, um, um, Cabalion. I don't have that one shiny. But I have all the other legendary shiny. <clears throat> News header. There's a, another one of those. <laughs> Glitches. Oh, boy. <laughs> I was still... Um, <laughs> I am the Swalrus. <laughs> That's a funny name. And um, I am still walking, at this point, my um, Sharpedo, who is battle with the best of them. And when you max him out, he's under 25,000, uh, or 2,500 in the CP, so he'll be good in the Ultra League. I need good Ultra League battlers, speaking of the uh, Go Battle League. And um, he also has a, um, a uh, what, uh, Mega form, so... <sighs> There's for Alligator in the wild, isn't that crazy? And, um, <clears throat> Pharisee'd. I don't know what I was searching for here. I don't know what I was searching for here. I think to show that I had... These were two hard ones to get as a lucky, and I finally got them lucky. I, I don't know why. I took a picture of that, but... Somebody has this. I don't have the, um, Licky Licky, but I do have Licky Tongue. I need to get another Licky Licky Tongue so I can evolve it. Um, Nido King in the wild, that's rare. Golduck in the wild, that's rare. Dom Fan in the wild, that's rare. Um, here's my eggs only, basically the babies, and shiny. Now, I've not evolved any of those up, and two of them I had to trade for. Um, so, there you go. Um, but I did trade away a bunch of Cleffas, and um, now I have another Cleffa to trade, because I, I get shiny Cleffas all the time, but uh, the Why Not is not good, but that's all right. Um, my uh, Badoo, which was traded to me, I gave her a Cleffa, I believe. It was a uh, Melpov, and she gave me a Badoo. I hatched all of those freaking eggs on the Rosalia day, or uh, Rosary day. Is it Rosalia? Yeah, Rosalia Community Day. And didn't get a freaking... I got so many Badoos, but no shiny ones. But she gave me one, and it ended up being Battle with the Best of Them, so that's awesome. Ludicolo in the Wild, that's rare. <clears throat> uh, Noibat. This is also Southside Tavern, across the street from Delco. I had seen one there, and then I had seen another one there, and I took a picture of it. And previously, I had seen another Noibat there. It's near a dead zone, I believe. In between... Southside Tavern, and um, there's a couple of back roads, and it's it's a path for a lot of people who raid and stuff to go through to go through that neighborhood to get between gems. Um, you know when they're when there's raid days or whatever, 
And uh, a couple of times that I did that, I found Noibats there. So keep that in mind. I do think it's a dead zone Pokemon, kind of like early on in the game when, you know, people had uh, couldn't find any Jinxes anywhere. Well, I found it behind <clears throat> a dead zone where there was no stops around or no um, gems around um, behind the Burger King on um, Dorothy Lane. But now that's not even there anymore, and that was years ago. And Jinx are everywhere. But here's Madison Square Garden. Oh, my God. Somebody gave me an invite from New York. So, boom. Had to take a picture of that. And um, what am I zooming in on here? Oh, there was two Frokies. Isn't that crazy? Two of them? I, I think there was actually three of them. But I was trying to... I didn't get it in time. I only got the two. Because I wanted to catch one of them, at least. Alakazam in the wild. Now, these are supposedly very hard to catch. I caught it. Um, yeah. There he is in the trash. <laughs> Grumpig in the wild. They had said to take a picture of a ground type, I think it was, for a task. So there's my Landris. Uh, 999. That's crazy. <laughs> uh, Thunderous... Tornadus and Landorus. So I don't have Thunderous or Tornadus is what I was trying to say earlier as a shiny. I rated a lot for both of those too. Agron in the wild. Crazy. And that was also on Incense. I got a couple of Agrons on Incense when they were doing the, the ground and steel types or whatever on Incense. That was crazy. Or Electric. I, they had so many different things going on with Incense in this last month. I have 199 friends. Now I have 198. I don't know who it was that got rid of me. Um, not too sure. I think... Uh, oh, I was close to 75 million total experience. So I took a picture of that. Um, another Arcanine in the wild. I did not get a shiny one. It's got to be 123. I thought that was a, kind of a cute name. Jolteon in the wild. Throw in the wild, 666. Oh, boy. <laughs> Uh, Gibble, that was 15 in attack and HP, but the defense was low, but whatever. Um, I don't know, what was I taking a picture of here? Oh, yeah, this is something, this is the compass Pokemon. So, as it says here, nose pass, magnetic nose all, is always pointed to the north. If two of these Pokemon meet, they cannot turn their faces to each other when they are close because their magnetic noses repel each other. So, you know, when you see them next to each other and they're they're facing other directions, they had, I think, a nose pass, uh, what is it called? A um, uh, spotlight hour? And, you know, I didn't get a shiny one. But north is this direction because here's my house, here's the bus stop, and um, boom, it's facing north. Interesting stuff, huh? David's Dog Buster. <laughs> whatever <clears throat> rock and roller 16 battle with the best of them that's crazy trading cooldown 15 I don't know if it's minute or seconds later I don't know I, I guess I was doing a bunch of trading and then I finally got a Skarmory in the wild myself um, there's a dra Dragonair in the wild Meganium in the wild 295 uh, 1990 Arcanine in the wild. <laughs> a crabby 0%. I, I, I took a picture of this before, but I took a picture again because somebody was saying that like 100% are, you know, shinies are, are uh, but the 0% are more rare. Well, I got a 0% and I got a lot of low ones. I don't have, I have a couple that are close to high, but they're, they're not, I don't have any 100% shinies no shundos these are my um shinies that are one click away from perfect so that's crazy two sets of mates of uh plus a and mine and i thought that was kind of cute i think i took another picture of them yeah <laughs> they were holding hands walking into park oh it wasn't a park but anyway there's uh shinies magneton in the wild that's rare electrode in the wild mm. 1523. That is what's really weird about this is I took a picture and then I took a picture and it was dark out. 725, 742. 
<clears throat> Anyways, there's a Voltorb in the wild. Oh, no, not Voltorb in the wild. There's a shiny Voltorb, I should say. I did not get a second one. That was during the uh, Spotlight Hour for it. Usually I don't get the... I either get a different one, or I get it around the time, or I don't get one at all. But this time I got one, so I was happy about that. Toxic Croak in the wild, that's, that's rare. Frillish was my my daily spawn that day, so that's pretty rare. Um, Tynam Tynamo, it's kind of like Dynamo, but Tynamo, he's very he's very small. Let's just say that on the map. Luminian in the wild. Darling Vespa. <laughs> I switched to Pichu. <clears throat> this is my lucky Pichu. It's my perfect Pichu. I have like three perfect Pichus and like two perfect uh, Pikachus, whatever. I'm going to evolve this one up, but I'm, I'm walking it now. I'm going to, I figured, oh, I got enough Pikachu candy. There's a, there's a task later on to get to level 50 or maybe it's level 48. I can't remember what it is, but it's level 48, 49, 50, something like that, where you have to have completely max out your Pokemon. And I was like, I got plenty of Pikachu candy. I still can't max this out. I got to get more Pikachu candy. <laughs> it's crazy. I leveled up 44. Um, yeah, got all that. Crazy. Uh, there's my shinies at the time again, and level 45 requirements, which is, uh, the rocket stuff. I'm still working on that. I think I'll get th through it faster than the other tasks before, because the other tasks before, I had to wait for the Go Battle Leagues to come, and I was missing them, and so I had to wait for the, I think it was the Ultra League to finally get around, and then I won a bunch of Ultra League battles so that I could get to level 44. Aaron as a shadow looks like a shiny, and I think it's kind of unfair. Another 666. Wow. I got surrounded by these things. They were just nuts, and I was taking this picture right as that one just popped up, too. So that was nuts. Uh, using him. Yeah, these are ridiculous. Use five berries to help catch Pokemon, and then you get two berries? Come on. And then I caught a just a random Pikachu. There was a bunch of electric types out around this time. And Pikachu, perfect in the wild. It's <laughs> crazy. Wingull, and I don't know if this was, I tried to take a picture of it for a task or something like that. I can't remember. Um, five hearts for your bunny. This was the weather week thing. Cast form, 666. Did not get a shiny of that. I did tons of tasks for that, field research for that. Um, why did I take a picture of this? And why is that on there? Okay. Um, yeah. That was crazy. Um, this is, it's clearly raining out there. You see this, right? And it wasn't a rainy form. Whatever. I'd have been mad if it would have been shiny. Three in a row of Luckies of all, the, well, at least the Kanto versions of Eevee. Um, Flareon, Vaporeon, and Jolteon. I, I loved that that happened because I was keeping extra ones of each of those and I had a ton of extra Eevees because I'm like, in order to get them all lucky, I'm going to have to evolve them or they're going to have to be their own individual form or whatever. <sighs> the next ones we'll work on are the ones that they're kind of easier to make. Um, so you don't have to randomly get lucky with the, <laughs> no pun intended, uh, get lucky with the, um, the evolves of Eevee to get these three forms. But those are out of the way. And I think I got a lucky Eevee too. So that's out of the way. But I got to get the other ones. And then when Sylveon comes out, comes out, um, I think I'll evolve my lucky Eevee into Sylveon so that it goes lucky too. So, but yeah, it was five luckies that night. That was nuts. I've gotten a lot, a lot of luckies in the, in, in this last month, by the way. And here's Scyther in the wild under 2,500. And it was a really good one. So another 666. Wow. 31, 31. That's just crazy, right? Just Dragonite found out in the wild. 667. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, I was talking about Paras before, right? I keep seeing Parasex. Everywhere, everywhere, no Paras. And Parasex, of course, can't be shining in the wild, but Paras can. 
And it's kind of annoying, man. It's kind of really annoying. <clears throat> I got 159 luckies there. So this is the money that I've earned from the rewards for doing the surveys. If you've got Google on your phone, if you've got an Android phone, do these. This, this is how I pay for a lot of my Pokemon Go stuff is doing those re those surveys and you know 490 surveys it doesn't seem it seems like whoa you've done almost 500 yeah but I got about a hundred so that's an average of like you know that's a lot that's a lot of free money that you can use for Pokemon go so check that out um, the spawns are finally beefing up around my apartment uh, finally everybody was it was about a I don't know, like six months ago when people were saying, oh, my spawns are great around my house now. And it's like, uh, <clears throat> not me. I'm still only getting two or three. But here, man, look at this. No incense. And I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> and that's if I don't walk around. If I walk around, I could get some back here and here. So, um, what was going on here? Why did I take this picture? Oh, because of both of the ducks. <laughs> um, bust of Dr. Chu Shun, Luma Linda, California. Oh, it kept showing up even though I had done it, and I accidentally ran away from it, so I couldn't go back into it. And even though it was there, it was it was goofy. Probably because it had expired or whatever, but not just the invite, but the actual entirety of the raid. These po popped up at the same time. I was trying to incubate, and then I... Psyduck was there. No wonder he's got a headache. This came up. Um, I, I now know what how to do this, but it's just weird because I was feeding my buddy. I was not trying to catch a Pokemon, so I don't know why they had the catch thing in there. But I guess they were just trying to sh say, you know, these are um, like tips when you hit the question mark above your berries or whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Anyways, there's another dragon here. Catch a ditto. I was... Pointing that out to somebody because I was like, oh, dittos are coming because it's April Fool's. And why did I take a picture here? Oh, I noticed the shadow around myself now. Isn't that crazy? Uh, maybe it's always been there, but it, it more prevalent now when it was raining then. I don't know. Another Arcanine in the wild. These are the luckies. I had 160 at the time that I took that picture. Somebody was like, how many luckies you got? Oh, yeah, okay. Got lucky. And these were the uh, the jokesters that showed up for my April 1st, or April Fool's Day, so. Uh, Ella Kid, 666, ugh. <laughs> okay, so now, instead of going into the game and talking about my blog and wasting a bunch of time, I made these pictures. These are the pictures for the end of the Pokemon Go um my basically my ending stats for the month so these are the luckies that i've gotten in the last month i'm at 162 now and i got a lucky ditto because there's so many daggone dittos and they were mainly in uh what was it purloin <laughs> anyways yeah look at all these are all from the last month starting with sand slash here <clears throat> and then starting with landorus these are all the ones that are one click away from perfect so yeah, that means two of the legendary Landorus's and another Gibble. I have like five Gibbles that are one click away from perfect. We're that close to perfect and nope, no perfects. And then I only got one perfect in this last month, that one goofy Pikachu that I didn't even need. <laughs> but there's that. Here is my distance ones recently. I got a good one or not good one, but uh, ones that I'm that I have like... When I capitalize these, that means that these are the ones that are representative of whatever country or state that they're in. So this is my first or whatever, New Jersey, Portugal, Italy, Turkey. And then I also got a Hawaii and I got that capitalized, but I don't have it spelled out because I don't want to keep him. I'm probably going to trade him and I want to trade him for another Hawaiian Pokemon, um, preferably an Alola one, because that just makes the most sense. Aloha, Hawaii, get it? Alola, whatever. Um, 
And then I got some other ones for trade and stuff like that, but I, I marked those out because those were from previous month. <clears throat> Speaking of trade, these are the ones that I've gotten in the last month for trade. These are the um, during the Fletchling Community Day. Got some extra Talon Flames with uh, their special move or their uh, Community Day move to trade. Articuno with Hurricane uh, to trade. That's under 2500 Noibat for trade, although I've already got a Lucky, so I don't really care about that. I need a Lucky Carablast. Um, Lander Assist for trade. Throws for trade. I need a Lucky one of those. Another Shiny Nidoran female for trade. Tynamo for trade. I need a Lucky of that. need a Lucky of uh, Frillish, too. <clears throat> All right, and then here's the, here's the Shinies from the last month, and not a lot. Not a lot. So Lander Assist is the first. Uh, I meant to mark these out because these were from last month. Then I got another Growlithe, which I think is actually, I'm going to evolve it, and then I'm going to have to trade away my Arcanine that I've already got because this one's better. Uh, I don't know. I haven't really looked through them. Uh, the ones that are marked for traded ones with the dollar signs, of course. I uh, got another Jigglypuff, and then I traded a Jigglypuff to Sarah, and then she caught another Jigglypuff, so she has three right now, and I got two, even though I caught three. <laughs> um, anyways... And then I got my Voltorb, so that was awesome, as all get out. I got a Beldum, but it wasn't a Shadow, and it wasn't Battle with the Best of Them. I still don't have a Battle with the Best of Them, Beldum. That kind of stinks. Got Skarmory. Um, that may end up being up for trade. I can't remember if it was better than the one that I already had. And then I got another P-Dove, which I'm not going to evolve yet, because I want to see what the best P-Doves that I have. I Because I, I have enough to make the whole family, but I want to make a male and female, and all of mine are male, which kind of sucks. And I do have a better P dove that I can evolve up to a male, but I just wanna, I just wanna wait after I catch my first female shiny one, which I heard is they're extremely hard to get. So, in fact, that's how I got my first P dove was somebody traded me a male because they were like, Ugh, I keep getting nothing but males. I don't have any, sh and I don't have any females. So, because you know, the um, P dove when they evolve all the way up, they're they're different when they're male and female. Are different looking. Here's my um, ones that are two clicks away from perfect, starting with Snorlax on up. Uh, four of them are lucky ones, <laughs> so that's crazy. I don't have very many lucky uh, perfect ones, though. And then here's my shadow ones in the last month, starting with Wobbuffet. I got a, that Articuno, uh, Aerodactyl. These are ones that I'm for now keeping as, as shadow. Um, only the Lie Leap was a battle with the best of them. The other ones were, eh. And here's a 999 Aerodactyl. That's kind of crazy. Um, there's supposed to be an event pretty soon where you can, um, uh, TM away frustration, but I'm only going to do that on the ones that I'm going to keep as a shadow. And only on the ones that I think, like, could evolve to a community day move or, like, you know, kind of like Aeron to Agron <clears throat> or. Or no, he doesn't have a community game move. I meant to say Larvitar to Tyranitar and stuff like that. Anyways, um, so that's the last picture, and that did make the video shorter. Um, still not as short as I wanted, but <clears throat> thanks for watching, and I will see you guys next month. Uh, happy hunting out there. Um, yeah. Uh, Next month, I will be showing you my results for April 2021. This was the battle with the best of them for March 2021. Happy hunting!